Welcome back to A and J Media. Here, we are talking about Batman: The Arkham Knight. So this is for the PlayStation 4. So where we left off is the guy is smoking in the corner over there. We're gonna go have a word with him. Uh, so as you can see, you can walk around. You can kind of look at everybody, see all the graphic. I mean, just lots of cool, innovative things here. Lots of colors. Lots of people. Got our nice guy here with some tattoos. So everybody has a detailed look. I mean, you can tell that the company's made... They've made a lot of progress. Paid attention to detail. I mean, even the candles are flickering. All right. So let's just go ahead and go visit this guy back here in the back. So it says... Confront smoking customer. Excuse me, sir. There's no smoking in here. So that was me interacting right there, shooting at what I could. But that scene actually happens right here. Okay, so here we are. At the very top of the screen, there's an exclamation point with a meter. This will show you where you need to go. Uh, so for those of you who've played Arkham City, Arkham Knight, um, the other Batman games, it's going to work the same. So there's our Batman costume that we chose at the beginning. Um, I did the pre-order, so I got an extra couple of suits there. No biggie. So it's going to tell us what to do as far as going to the city. So we're just going to jump off here. And we're going to hold the X button. That does the gliding. And then if we hold X and R2, it does a dive bomb. And then we can pull up. And Batman's floating again. Uh, so there it is, 300 meters, 200 and whatever. There we go. We basically want to get to that point. So we can dive bomb again. Okay, so as they're talking here, you can actually rotate the camera around just using your up. right analog Somehow thumbstick. Okay, I'm sending through the squad car's location. Be careful. It's not looking good out there. So the Oracle character unlocked. You can push the big black button, your trackpad, on your PlayStation 4. Woo! The back computer. So this shows you some profiles. There's Alfred... Bruce Wayne. So there's the Oracle. That's the chick you were just talking to. And of course there's Scarecrow. If you press the X button, it'll tell you their occupation, eye, hair color, all that good fun stuff. This is the Wayne Tech screen. It says use this to move through your list to the upgrade point. Uh, this is going to work kind of like Disney Infinity. It's got the little spider web. You can choose to upgrade your armor. You can choose to upgrade your combat skills. You can choose to upgrade the Batmobile. Whatever you guys would like, this is going to be your Batman, so you can customize him however you see fit. So here you go right here. So if you want to do the moves list, you can go into here. There's combat. So there's the Predator. Um, so basically, Batman can be his own Dark Knight according to your skills as you see them fit. Uh, so we're going to continue to move here. Alright, so I still have about 480 meters to go. 
So what we're going to do is we're going to get to that 400 and whatever meters left. And when we come back, we will be at our destination. So until then, this is A&J Media signing off. We will be right back. I'm Batman! If you liked what you saw, click on the next one, which is up at the top. If you like what you see after that, click the next one on the bottom. This is A&J Media signing off, and to you gamers, have a great day.